What's up, everyone? Toy Insanity here with some Kitty Insanity. Not Insanity. Squirrel Insanity. Rat Insanity. Not Insanity. Kitty Insanity. Weird Insanity. Happy National Walnut Day. This is Nut Insanity Official Episode 4. This year we have looked at and tasted. Let's see if I can remember. Almonds, pistachios, pecans. And today, May 16th, <coughs> National Walnut Day. Okay? I usually I have a squirrel toy figure pop cultural product. But today I have a rat. Because first of all, squirrels and rats are very closely related. They're like cousins. And second of all, today is also National Pack Rat Day. Wow, 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 wow. Toy hoarders unite. The rat named Rennie, the, na, the, the rat named Remy, the kitty named Buzzy. Buzzy. Okay, pistachios, almonds, pecans. I love all those walnuts. I love the, I love this image. Look at that freaky walnut lady just coating herself in the juice of another tree. Maple flavored walnuts. Walnuts must suck so hard. We gotta put. Maple juice on them. Okay, and I got an Antwick. Uh, this belongs to Grandma Insanity. She said it's over 100 years old. Oh my gosh. The first nut out is shaped like a heart. Look at that. Fuzzy. That's for you. That's insane. Listen. Can cats eat walnuts? Didn't look it up. Mmm. Not great. So, the insanity calendar seems to be presenting these nut insanity explorations. In uh, descending order of my interest, not a huge fan of walnuts. They are strictly neutral to me. I guess the maple helps. Love almonds, love pistachios. I think pecans are slightly above neutral. I do like them a lot, but I don't love them. Walnuts were dipping slightly below neutral. And it's another droop. So you know how it is with a walnut. Culinarily, it's a nut. Botanically, it is a droop, not a true nut, because it has that exo, what's it called, a exocarp, the outer skin, then it has the mesocarp, the fleshy thing that we discard. It dries up and becomes a husk in this case. And then the endocarp, the hard shell. And then, inside that, we find a seed kernel. That. This is what we eat. Okay, I, I want to save that one. Why? Because I'm a pack rat. Okay. Good, not great. Hang on. Where my cat go? No. The next nut insanity will finally be a true nut. June first. Can you guess what it is? All right. It's pretty good. All right. So the English walnuts originated in Persia, Iran. Okay. But the U.S., uh, North America, does have its own species. Native species of walnuts called the black walnut. I assume that's what these are. California walnuts, which would be black walnuts. You know, why would we be getting... Uh, Walnuts from Europe over here. Contains walnuts. Ingredients. Walnuts. Maple sugar cane. Sugar cake. Ma <clears throat> maple sugar cane syrup. Manufactured by Crazy Go Nuts. Fresno, California. Great little image. Okay. Dollar Tree. And. Movie. Movie. Ratatouille. No, Ratatouille. Why is it called that? Because, you know, it sounds like a rat. And it's about rat chef. Living the dream. He woke up and he chose to live the dream. 12,000 made box lunch exclusive. Will I find the chase? 
No, because it's already open and I got it on eBay. Remy's Ratatouille Adventure. Let's see it. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. He always reminds me of me because he's a little bit of a pack rat, you know what I'm saying? And because he pursues his dream relentlessly. Anyone can cook. All he wants to do is cook. Wait, okay, I don't know. I don't know if I want to identify with Remy. He will stop at nothing to cook. No empathy. No, total disregard for human life. And I don't think he's really that nice to his brothers either. Well, he was bullied by his own dad, right? By the way, if you want to call, if you want to bully a squirrel for some reason, you call it a tree rat. <laughs> they hate that. But here's the thing. I watched that movie when it first came out, 2007, and I, and I absolutely hated it. And I recently rewatched it. And I'm trying to decide, do I still hate it? I'm trying to see the positives in it. There's some weird scenes. That kiss scene is really weird. He forces a kiss on Linguini and that lady. And she doesn't decide she likes him until after the kiss is like, woo, she's deep in it. Ooh, awkward scene. I think there's a shootout scene. There's a lot of adult innuendo. Like a lot. Is it rated G, PG? It, it, it doesn't matter. The question is only this. Do I like it, that movie now? I think I do not like the movie, but I can kind of... Also, I don't like, you know, don't at me. I don't like Patton Oswalt. There's probably things I can like about it. Let's, let's focus on the positive today. Good vibes only. It, it has good music. It has a good score. Um, I don't know. I like the idea. I think I like the idea. Okay. The rats. By the way, I'm fine with all these conceits. Suspended disbelief kind of stuff. I'm fine with talking animals and movies and stuff like that. I, I kind of like that the rats can talk to each other. And the rats can interact with the humans. But the rats cannot talk to the humans. That was a good choice. Oh yeah, but why is it called Ratatouille? Because the food critic, Ego, when he comes back to be served at the restaurant, I think after everyone's made aware that rats are making the food, that's what they decide to make. And it's just the right dish to hit Ego's nostalgia buttons to fire off all his, uh, I don't know. It just did it for him. It just hits like it did in his childhood. Suddenly he loved this restaurant. Yeah, it's just, there's so many s weird things in this movie. So the dude that ran the restaurant was having an affair, and then all of a sudden, L little Luigi, who just happened to apply for a dishwashing position or a mop the floor position, he turns out he's the illegitimate son of the heir. No, he's the heir of the, uh, you know, the titan of French food industry. Uh, okay, it's pretty weird. But anyone can cook. Ratatouille. It's zucchini, eggplant, squash. It's a vegetarian dish. Mainly those three things. And it also has onion, tomato, bell peppers. <sighs> but I've never had it. It don't look delightful. Onion. It, wait, onions are delicious. Eggplant, squash, zucchini. That sounds like the kind of thing you want to eat. I'd rather just sit here and eat walnuts all day. Uh, happy National Walnut Day. Happy National Pack Rat Day. Love you all. Goodbye. Thumbs up for nut insanity. Smash like for Blanco insanity. See you real soon. <coughs> Goodbye.